Okay, so we're going to take our legs wide and we're going to open up the lines of the liver on the inner part of the thigh. Okay, so taking your hands and interlacing them behind the head, pull your elbows back. We want the toes pulled back strong and the backs of knees pressing down. Breathe in and exhale coming forward. Now just see how far forward you're able to go. And then breathe in, come back up. We're just going to do three of these. So exhale forward. Now we want to come with a straight spine. We don't want to curl the head to the floor. We actually want to push the belly and the chest down before the face and then breathe in, come back up, and then exhale, coming down, and breathe in, come back up. Now we're gonna try and make a bit of an improvement on that. So breathe in, we're gonna side stretch for the gallbladder. So taking your right elbow to the inside of your right knee and pull the top elbow right back. Now keep your left bottom on the floor and push through that left heel, and then breathe in, come up. And we do the other side, exhale going over, elbow on the inside of the knee. You can push against it to pull the top arm back a little stronger. And breathe in, come back up. And we're gonna do 10 of those. One, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight and nine and ten coming up and now we're going to turn over the right leg so we're trying to go we're going to pull our middle of our chest towards the middle of the knee big breath in and exhale we come down middle of chest to middle of knee keeping the elbows lifted and keep that bottom on the floor the opposite bottom and breathe in, come up, and exhale, coming over, one, and two, three, four, five, six, seven, and hold the next one down. Now keep your elbows lifted, elbows are parallel, breathe in, and then exhale, twist to look behind you. So lift that right elbow up and come back to level. Exhale, twist again and come back. And exhale, twist again, twist from the waist and come back. Now we should be able to come a little lower over the leg. Breathe in, we'll do three more twists going one, looking behind, two, and squeeze, 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 squeeze. And then coming down with your hands. So we want one hand on each side of the leg and we pull the middle of your chest over the middle of the thigh and we keep pushing this opposite bottom into the floor. So as we pull the body to the right, the left bottom pushes into the floor and the left heel pushes away. So constantly working between those two. Body to the right, left bottom down. Body to the right, left bottom down. And as you do that, you might feel a bit of a squeeze in this left side as we activate the ovary and we get the energy flowing and the blood flowing through the pelvis more evenly. So pulling the middle of the chest to the middle of the thigh. Drop the crown of the head now toward the toes. Keep pushing the left bottom down and the left heel away. And then just walking back to the center. And we might already be a little lower than we were before. Okay, so we're gonna do all of that on the other side.